The Onderon military has stepped up their presence around Onderon. If you try to go back there in your ship, they're blockading any Republic ship. Either you're very lucky, or you're a lot tougher than you look. Kelborn said you dispatched some covert military scouts in the jungle with him. He spoke highly of your work. Zuka told me you helped out with some repairs around the base. I was hoping you'd prove yourself more with a lightsaber, but it's certainly a great help. The gate guard said you managed to kill a Zakik. Those are tough beasts, Jedi. You've earned some respect around here. How many Kanoks did you have to kill to find those parts for Zuka? That was a tremendous help. I won't forget it. You've made quite a reputation around here. You did better than I thought you could. I was planning on heading to Isis tomorrow, but I'll move up the timetable and take you now. You won't be able to get to the Ebon Hawk from the city. If you need to grab anything from your ship, I'd do it now. I know, it made quite a racket. Good work. That's to be expected. They don't really like it when someone makes loud noise in their territory. It wouldn't be much of a test if all you had to do was take a hike through the jungle, now would it? You're alive, in one piece, and learn something about the beasts of the jungle. Are you ready to go to ice? Kelborn told me that they were covert military and probably aligned with Colonel Tobin from ISIS. Kelborn doesn't think they'll send out any more scouts, but that doesn't mean there aren't more of them out there. Colonel Tobin is General Vaclo's right-hand man. Despite his martial skill, he handles himself as a function. Back when we were fighting Vaclo's resistance during the Mandalorian Wars, Vaclo... Are you ready to go to... I'm going to talk with Zuka and have him start a shuttle flight check. After that, we'll head out. How are the port stabilizers? They check out Mandalore. All systems are green. Good. I want the shuttle bound for Onderon within the hour. What do you want? Is all in readiness? <laughs> it is. Like I promised. Why? You want to back out now? My only concerns are for the one you escort to Onderon, Mandalorian. Would you do any less for one of your clan? Don't pretend to understand us. We Mandalorians are a breed apart. If by apart you mean scattered, broken, and lost, then yes, you are correct. Not for long. Soon the Mandalorians will be strong again, united as one clan under one banner. Mine. Ah, yes. The Great Crusade. After the first one was ended by Revan and the Jedi. Such a defeat was merciful, an echo of the end, when your ships were in flames, crushed in the grip of Malachor V. But I do not need to remind you of such things. I was at Malachor V, and I remember how many Jedi died to stop us there. And no matter how many dead orbit that planet, the Mandalorians still live. Clan Ordo still lives. See Kex there? He was serving on Nar Shaddai's muscle for the huts. Kelborn was a scout for the Duros on Frontier Worlds. I brought them here, gave them a purpose. This galaxy will be ours again, I promise you. That is the future. Indeed. The future is always in motion. It is a difficult thing to see. Perhaps there will be no New Age Mandalore, no great Mandalorian crusade. Perhaps your people fought their last battle at Malachor V, and you have been dying ever since, a quiet death that will last centuries. And perhaps all that remains will be what I see before me. A man wounded by a Jedi, encased in a Mandalorian shell, hunted by the thought of being the last of the Mandalorians. You've got some guts talking to me like that. You think your age or your Jedi whelp are going to keep you safe from me? No, Mandalore, you are wrong. I hope that it is you who will keep the one I travel with safe. You are loyal, and you have served many masters, even when they abandoned you. Do you wonder where he wanders now, Mandalore? Why he gave you your orders, then abandoned you at the edge of the galaxy? How do you know that? 
I know many things, and I can answer the question that burns within your shell, Mandalore. But there is a price. You must keep the one I travel with safe. She is important to me, more important than anything. Show the same loyalty you have shown in the past, Mandalore. If there is a Mandalorian crusade, let it be for something that will carry your people's memory into the future. So when the time comes when there are no more Mandalorians, then at least their honor will remain. The one I travel with has walked your same path, and I ask that when the end comes that you remember that kinship, even if it seems there is nothing else left. Forget the Jedi. Keep your eyes on her. Mm. One, two, three. Mandalorians, we've got company. Stealth targets have breached our perimeter. Wait a moment. I sense there is a disturbance in the camp. Our enemy has tracked us here. I did not expect them so soon. How did they get here, I wonder? Regardless, we must eliminate them all. None of them can escape. Our whereabouts must remain a secret. Let us join the battle. Our allies will need our help. Vaklu's saying that the Republic ship attacked first? That's madness! Unfortunately, lie or not, it's a madness people will believe. The timing of this is atrocious. A space battle above our skies? So many of our fighters lost? Curiously, only Tobin's men were involved in that battle. That's Shuta! Strong word, Your Majesty. But there is no good time for news like this. I recommend we continue with our plan. But won't that bring even more followers to Vaklu's side? Increasing his power? For a time, perhaps. But we both know he's not the true threat. It's his unseen support from the shadows that we must drag out into the light. Then, and only then, can we strike. I fear by then it will be too late. Here we are. The city of Isis. It's been shut down tight for months now. General Vaklu is close to declaring martial law. We won't be able to travel too far in the city. Fortunately, I have a friend in this quarter of the city. He's a doctor by the name of Dagon Ghent. His office is on the other side of the market square. It might be best if you do the talking around here. The Andoronians have a mixed view of Mandalorians after we conquer their world. Thank you. 
Thank you. 
It's been a while since you've docked here, eh? I suppose the lockdown has hurt your profits as well. Oh, it must be hard to shuttle people when nobody's allowed to leave. The blockade has been bad for everyone. Your manifest says it's been two months since you last came here. It's become much worse since your last trip. Military checkpoints are everywhere. Nothing new. Space forces have been in full readiness. All Republic vessels must be searched, and the delays are turning pilots grey. Bad days. Bad days. And things... Well, doesn't look like you have any trade goods, so the inspection's just a formality. Here's your Starport visa. Don't lose it. They're priceless. There's strict food and water rationing, and General Vaclu's troops have been very thorough in finding Republic dissidents. Bombing's very common. If you want to leave the planet, you need a starport visa. They're very hard to get. But many people want to get out of here before things get worse. Certainly. Mind what I said about the starport visa. I know one captain already who can't get back into the starport.
can't believe the Republic is all there. General Vaclu was an underground resistance leader during the Mandalorian occupation. <laughs> Fair winds to you, Offworlder. Is it too much to hope that you are to these beasts? But we have stuck. They have been kept in their. Perhaps it is the city itself. Control! I... I don't know what to say. I had heard, not since my first Drexel have I lost... So sorry for insulting you with my offer. Halt, Offworlder. What is your business on? I don't think your business is any concern of mine. Use caution when affecting the minds of others. Some have been scarred by its use, both the user and the recipient. While you're at it, tell them to forget he ever saw it. Could be useful. Not only is your business not my concern, I can't seem to remember why I'm holding you up. You're free to go. Don't lose your Starport visa, otherwise you won't be leaving for a long while. Let's hurry this up. I want him escorted out of here quickly. This is outrageous. I'm not a spy. I'm a journalist for Isis Calm. You're a Republic spy in your propaganda. But, well, you can't be serious. You accuse- One more word of treason out. What are you looking at? This is none of your business. Please, ma'am, help me. Vaklu's troops won't listen. I'm just a journalist, not a spy.
Hmm. Men, let's take this spy away. Another word out of you and we can make the trip very uncomfortable. You have the look of someone used to adversity. Everyone around here begs and pleads night and day for open starport visas. I offer you 2,000 credits if you find an open... I only know of one person who might offer something comparable. And what's going on there is illegal. I'm a legitimate trader. There's only one thing ultimately more important than money. And that's your life. She's tr- I want nothing to do with her. If you want to get involved with that sort of person, you'll have to figure it out on your own. No, I don't think so. In the Council of Lords today, Lord Dashiel recommended a special commendation for Colonel Tobin Due to his brilliant command, without him, Lord Dashiel said, the Republican... Welcome to what must be the smelliest place in the universe, Offworlder. How can I assist you? That's an air defense tower. The si tower's like... A Drexel is a flying beast. Huge creatures with teeth the size of your arms. Lethal, and skin like ferrosteel plates. Somehow the Beast Riders figured out how to tame them years ago. Stay out of trouble. There must come a time when the Queen bows to the will of the people. The Republic has brought nothing but war and back General Vaclow and his... For all that we have given, now we get... Are you with me? No, they take from us. They are like Minox, sucking energy and resources from so many worlds. They bleed us for their bureaucracy and their excesses. That's enough, Ponlar. If you keep this up, you're going to spend time in detention. You're coming awfully close to treason. You can't silence me forever, soldier. But I'll keep my peace. For now. Unnecessary observation. Targets acquired. Recitation. I have questions for you. Malik during the Mandalorian Wars? Why? <laughs> We'd never faced Jedi before, and didn't know th You've always been in the Jedi Order. Things that are- We only knew what we had seen in Holovids and from our experience with Exar Kun. And by that time, he was completely a Sith. We thought we would triumph easily over such noble and compassionate leaders. Those are weaknesses we easily exploited in the past. What did you think of us?
that so? Ever consider what would have happened if we'd won? The Sith, we would have brought a new age of strength and expansion to the Republic. Look around you. Look at what you're... I ask you this. Is the galaxy better off for... Just think about it. Now, was there something else you needed? Like us, the people of Onderon are warriors. Early in their history, they built ISIS to protect them from the beasts that swarmed on their world. No matter how far they've progressed, they're fundamentally still warriors standing watch on their battlements. They don't like outsiders and their inability to take ideas from other cultures gives them a fundamental disadvantage in warfare. They fell quickly during the Mandalorian Wars despite their martial skills. Their technology and doctrine are not in the same league as Mandalorians. Now is there something else you needed? I have a job for someone like you. I am a strong supporter of General Vaklu. The Merchant Quarter is an important area, not only financially but strategically as well. This presents complications for Vaklu. If you could arrange for them to be removed from... There's Galisi at the Starport. Riken commands from the Turret Tower. And Bastuko guards the entrance to the Sky Ramp. All loyal. He's the most junior of the captains. His superior, Captain Sulio, met with an accident. I believe you're familiar with that. Besides his strong loyalty to the Queen, I know next to nothing about it. He's been responsible for the Merchant Quarter for years. He's been chastised repetitively for his criticism of General Vaklu. His years of service won't protect him if he continues to subvert the chain of command. He has received several warnings. With a nudge, he just may get a dishonorable discharge. Try to get General Vaclu to be on our side. He has a queen. Talia is young and 
too idealistic. Vaclu is no fool. Even if we've had disagreements in the past, he'll recognize how advantageous an alliance could be between us. Kawana bota ayuka taigwa kan dahupa bosa kurata tavadumpa munsuru ku mogachi norta hirembe wanachi ka kawana bota yun kawana bota ayuka taigwa kan kidora ya sora ku tuka ulwanji yo malifa chanek ma winbok lelenko so baramwe tavadumpa munsuru ku plagliya wa Bo bagaragawanda yaitua ulwanji yuma. Kawana bot. Tong hite mosi jochia yumba. The sky ramp is restricted to military. Chara, Granacha, Gan Ragichi Sana, Ragichi Sana, Dakosha, Nichotono, Jumkarantaka, Chona Bograwe, Katia, Bahasan Chan, Honka Kilikun. <coughs>
I am 1B. This is Dagon Ghent's place. He's not the best doctor you'll ever meet, but he's well connected in this city. Doesn't look like he's here right now, though. You're looking for Dagon? You're not gonna find him here. A soldier captain was murdered at the cantina real good. They got some suspects at the tower. He's certainly capable of it, and probably stupid enough to get caught. But we need him. It's the turret tower on the other side. If you talk to him, tell him I got... We saw Mogo Dosi Shebaden Bram Tabanis. Yatuka, who one Rika, Chotim, Wanim, Aurata Wakata, Chiluma, Kabadumpa, Mo Wendido, Chokerembi, Norta Kunyun, Wish Chawaka. Thank you. 
General, we have found them again. Have we, Tobin? Or is this a preface to another of your failures? Consider the whole field, Tobin. Why would a Jedi risk all of this just to come to Isis? The crew of the Ebon Hawk is elusive, General. We were warned about that, but we still underestimated them. But the fools are here, in Isis. The intel on this is certain. Hmm. I think I have an idea. The Jedi may prove a solution to another one of our persistent problems. Please tell me you're an off-worlder. You are. Wait, this is not... But this is good news! You have a starport visa, right? Watch it, Keg. The captain already has an... No need to be alarmed, my foreign friend. Pay the soldier no... Back again, Offworlder? I'm sure. We certainly do. He and several other people were picked up in. Captain Sulio. She was in charge of the Starport checkpoint. A good soldier. So far, he's just a suspect. But if he did. Dagon Kent is the only person I know with the contacts to help us out. We need to get Dagon out of custody. Until we either eliminate him as a suspect or find the real killer. Dagon has quite a record with the author- No way. We're under orders to- I know Dagon personally. He's one of the worst doctors I've ever heard of. But I can't see him deliberately killing someone. He was one of the last people seen with Captain Sulio in the cantina. Ask around there. I've heard he's got a good motive for killing her. If you can somehow clear that up and prove it wasn't him, Command will cut him loose. If I say any more, I'll get in trouble. No way. We're under orders to make sure no one sees the murder suspect. Stay out of trouble. So, you're back. I only know of one person who might offer something. There's only... So, you're...
Does it matter? Truly matter? No. I only know of one person who might offer something comparable. And what's going on there is illegal. I'm legit. There's only one thing ultimately more important than money, and that's your life. She's trouble. I wouldn't deal with her. So, you I only know of one. There's only one. No, I'm... Yes, is so. So, you're back. Does it matter? Truly matter? No, I have. So, does it matter? Truly matter? I only. There's. So...